Hello truckers and welcome back to American Truck Simulator where the Christmas event is here and it is different than before, that is for sure. The Cruising Kansas event is still going on. I still got one more city to deliver to or from and that's Marysville. Um, I just kind of looked on because it's 6 o'clock in the morning, I rested through the night. I was looking for a external contract going to Marysville and currently there isn't nothing. So I think I'm going to kind of focus on the Chris Christmas, <laughs> the Christmas Winterland uh, event. Uh, let's, let's go ahead and read about it in case you know about it. Uh, the good thing about this is usually I record an episode and then something like this drops. Just before I was getting ready to record this episode, this dropped. So luckily I got it in uh, for this week. Um, so there are unique depots and total deliveries that you got to do. Uh, so it's using external contracts uh, connected to your World of Trucks profile. And you can do it doing Euro Truck or American Truck. So there are five different depots in Winterland for all deliveries to and from. They are the Christmas Market, uh, Marigolds, North Star, Rudolph's Crafts, and Snowy Peaks. Uh, your personal goal is to complete 15 deliveries from them, including at least one delivery to or from each uh, depot using Euro Truck Simulator or ATS or both games combined. Uh, snowflakes are gained for these uh, for those cities that have delivered to or from uh, or sorry, delivered to or received from Winterland. For a city to receive one snowflake, the community needs to complete 1,000 deliveries between it and Winterland. Each city can receive up to five snowflakes. Uh, the community goal is to reach at least 1,000 snowflakes. And I'll tell you, the uh, Euro truck people are smashing that down already. Um, for cities across all trucking territories, a unique community reward will be unlocked for each tier of 200 snowflakes accomplished with five tiers in total. Uh, so your contribution of 15 or more deliveries to or from the five Christmas Winterland depots will gain you a World of Trucks achievement and a special paint job, which I can never afford in this series because paint jobs, as we know, uh, base game paint jobs like this can go anywhere from like 20 to $40,000. Uh, but either way, community, there will be five tiers to unlock. Each tier will bring a special cabin item reward for both games based on the five amazing depots uh, within the Christmas Winterland. So let's haul. Uh, this will end. I did not see. I did not read yet. Uh, so you got until the 14th of January to complete it. So we're going to get started on today. Like I said, uh, I kind of went into external contracts. And by the way, um, I uploaded the coast to coast map because there was a problem with the city. I forgot which one, but there was no traffic in it. And they also fixed, I think, two invisible walls on a road somewhere. So I updated it. So I had to teleport back. I couldn't. We were in Phillipsburg, but we were like somewhere up here. I couldn't teleport to Phillipsburg because there is no service in Phillipsburg. So we're in Colby, Kansas. And you can see uh, we got snowflakes. You can see the snowflakes around everywhere. I think for ATS, Kansas is going to be um, the highest because I think most people are going to be cruising Kansas anyways. So we're in Colby, Kansas. Uh, so I want to search, since I'm back in here, anything going to Mary, no, there's nothing going to Marysville. So we'll focus on the Christmas deliveries. So this was going to the arts workshop. Uh, you can see it doesn't pay much. Um, so we're just going to go ahead and begin delivery. It's showing, it's showing, I, I don't know what the what they're showing me here. Um, as you know, this is my first one, so we'll just, well, let's go to Target. We'll get the Christmas natural textiles. I think that's what it said. And we're just going to start delivering these things. I, I don't know. Um, maybe we'll... I, I mean, if they're short distances, I'm going to knock off the, the five depots quick. Maybe. I, I, <laughs> I could be mistaken. So I should also mention that uh, as we're loading in here, it's probably going to take a second because I actually have loaded the winter uh, season. So it's going to be, it, well, it might be snowing. I don't know if it will be, but there will be snow on the ground. Um, the winter mod has nothing to do with the Christmas event. At least I don't think, because I didn't try it. The winter event, or sorry, the, the, the winter mod that I'm using is from Grimm's. Uh, and it should be in link below for, to get to his mod site. And this is updated for 1.49. Uh, you can see our money's up to 123. So we're getting closer to buy, you know, buy another truck for the Dallas uh, garage. All right, so I think we are we are good to go. Um, let's see where are we, where am I going here? Oh, I'm in ninth gear. That's that's why. Let's 
All right, and then to the left here. Yeah, see, see, this is what happens when you do uh, Alaskan road truckers before this. You drive the same way where you just pull in the traffic. Like, yeah, it doesn't matter. We're in ATS now, so let's go ahead and and, and try to drive safe. So I should mention uh, for those of you who know about the the winter mod. I only did the the snow effect. I'm not doing the physics to where the roads are going to be slippery or anything like that. I just want to enjoy the scenery of the snow. So that's why it's really dark because it's winter and um, it's only 6 o'clock in the morning. Uh, only three miles to go to go pick up whatever it is we're picking up. I think last year like the, tra the trailer was all like uh, had Christmas lights on it and all that kind of stuff. So it'll be interesting to see what the trailers look like. I didn't really look at the trailer that SCS posted. Um, so I don't know if it's going to be flashing or not. I have no idea. And yes, my lights are all on. I like my in-cab lights dim. Uh, my eyes are very sensitive to light. I do the same thing in real life for my, uh, for my truck. I got my dashboard lights very low. So eventually we'll get over to Marysville so I can do a delivery to or from there. So I'm going to try to work over there doing these deliveries. But like I said, we got in like end of January to do that. Uh, get that cruise in Kansas done. But it would be nice just to get it done. You know? And I think maybe once we get these... Uh, the cruise in Kansas and maybe the Christmas one's done. Um, when I I was going, I don't know if it was last episode or the episode before, but I've been seeing the comments come in uh, about people wanting me to go back to California because um, we really haven't been there. I don't know. California is just not just one of those one of those uh, states driving up and down. I I don't mind the California. I think it's just the the speed limit restrictions that they have in that state just drive us all nuts. You just want to go a little bit quicker than what you think you should be going, and, and, and it's not going to happen. Well, I mean, you can. If you got the fines turned off, that's great. Um, but if you don't, uh, where am I going here to get this delivery? Am I going around? All right, let's not, uh, let's not hit the... Uh, the poles they got out front here because that will damage my truck pretty darn good. Maybe. So good news uh, as well. While we're on it. Oh, there's the trailer right there. Um, about uh, Alaskan road truckers that will be coming out later this afternoon. Yeah, that should be later this afternoon. Um, I, uh, we will be on the ice roads. So if you watched yesterday's episode of me faffing around trying to figure why I can't go on the ice roads, that problem... For me, has been solved. And I will tell you, it, it's kind of interesting what happens. All right, let's hook up to the trailer. All right, let me go ahead and put the parking brake on for a second. Let's have a look outside. Uh, yeah, I would say nothing like last year. I mean, they do got a lot of parking lights going around the trailer. Um, we'll get a better look at it as the sun rises. It might actually blend in with the truck kind of well. Um, as for doing... Uh, how about you put it in gear there, moron? Uh, <laughs> um, I, I don't know if I'm going to be doing a Christmas paint job or not. If I get the time, I... Well, think of something, maybe. Wait, where? GPS is not showing me anything. Uh, is this part of it? Is this part of the quest where GPS is not going to show me where I got to go? Do I have to find these on my own? I'm confused. 
All right, so I can deliver them. So they're giving me choices, I think. Okay, so those are the choices. I got to pick it myself. Okay, well, we can we can kind of do that. All right. Um, I think this is how it's working. <laughs> I have no idea. Um, up to this uh, fuel depot, we shall go. Let's go ahead and mark that. Sorry, uh, dude, pulling out in front of you. That was really rude of me, I know. Sorry, I'm a little flustered right now. Uh, so it's only 48 miles. Wonder what time the sun's actually going to come up because I don't remember. We did run this winter mod. Uh, but at least it's the updated version here. Uh, I don't remember what time the sun comes up. Like 7.30 maybe? I hope I'm doing this right. We'll, we'll find out. Oh yeah, so the thing is where we're delivering... We're not really delivering to another, like, depot, a logistics center. So we're delivering to, like, a fuel station. Which means I just can't go and just take a trailer from the logistics center I usually deliver to, because you're not at one. So I may actually have to bobtail it back somewhere. Meaning going back without a trailer, because there's nothing there to grab. This is interesting. Alright, I'm going to try to not to do it uh, Alaskan road truck style here. We are going to obey the signs to a point. Stop signs, we kind of do a rolling stop. Ah, as the sun comes, it's starting to get a little bit brighter outside, and look at that, nice and, looks nice out there with all the snow on the ground. I like it in the video game, not so much in real life anymore. Yeah, when you're a kid and it snows, it's great, you get to go outside, make snowmen, snowball fights, snow forts. Maybe it reminds you a little bit like, you know, Christmas time, and you know, you're gonna get a whole bunch of gifts, you hope. As you get older, you see snow on the ground, you think, got to clean up the car, got to shovel the driveway, got to got to shovel the sidewalk. Um, I got to drive in this crap all day long. <laughs> so the good news is, I mean, we're not going far to deliver these things. If I'm doing this correctly. So yeah, on on the mod description below, I think I got to call the Grim seasonal seasonal mods, and this is the winter mod. Um, you can download other options for uh, a slippery road and the physics, kind of like that. I think I did it last year, um, and, and, and it works pretty well. well. At least it did last year. Uh, I assume it's the same thing as it would be this year. I can't see that changing in the mod itself. But here we're just going with the snow itself because, yeah, this didn't feel like uh, slipping and sliding today. And with the Christmas event on, I just wanted the snow on as well. I could turn the percentage of moisture to fall. I was to say rain, you know, rain possibility. But obviously, instead of rain, we will get snow. Alright, so this is the fuel station. Wait, I see see the snow falling? Is that where I got to deliver it to? I bet you that's where we're delivering it to. 
Uh, before we do, now it's just a little bit brighter. Let me put the parking brake on. Let's have a better... Well, I'm okay. It's not a great look at the trailer. Yeah, we'll have to wait until we do another one. I mean, we can kind of see what it looks like. All right, let's go ahead and... Um, it, it's kind of weird because there is no marking on the ground. It's just by the snow. Oh, parking brake is still on. Yeah. That would help if I turn it off. So I'm just going to try to, like, parallel park next to this other truck. Which I missed completely. Well, there is... Is, there, is that a... That might be a logistics center right across the street from us. Again, I don't know if this is what we should be doing. Use the following key to stop the engine. Wait, did you, it sounds like like bell. I was gonna say jingle bells, but I don't, don't mean the song jingle bells. There's like bells playing. Or all right, stop the engine. Press the following key to travel through the portal. Oh. What? <laughs> We're passing through a portal? Um, SCS, excuse me, what? Let, let's travel through a portal. Uh, I'm gonna sit in the truck though, cause I, I feel safer inside of a truck. Uh, Cindy, you ready for this? How come it feels like you're sitting a lot higher than me today? Let me readjust my, okay, that seems better. Are we going to like the North Pole or something? I can't have much more in the drive because I mean, I'm not getting paid that much so that the mileage is not going too far. Um, <laughs> This is the perfect quote. Cindy, I don't think we're in Kansas anymore. <laughs> Where the heck am I? Another 41 miles, but it's going to take me two hours and 47 minutes to get there. I didn't see how much this weighs, 43,000 pounds. So again, I'm not sure because I'm using the winter mod. I'm not sure if you come up here without the winter mod, there might be snow up here anyways. I have no idea. Uh, I am curious a little bit. I'll wait until we get this delivered. Um, I want to check the map. <laughs> I want to see what this map looks like. I'm guessing there is probably snow up here anyways. But either way, right now it does look nice. I'm guessing this is just a separate map with all the five locations on it and we're just delivering to one of them. Not 13th gear, 9th gear would be good.
sorry, just uh, just enjoying the scenery. I think is what I'm doing. Whoa, 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 whoa. That wasn't the truck sliding in the snow, that's just me just driving like I do. Sixteen miles to go. Is it gonna take me an hour to get there? Let's see, it's eight thirty. We'll say this is a rather interesting event and I'm trying to think if they ever done anything like this before and off the top of my head I'm not thinking of anything right now so I mean time seems to be going by a little bit Quick, but not that quick and I think I'm getting there I mean it was gonna be 930 but it looks like I'm gonna get here at 9 whoa, whoa, whoa okay I thought I was gonna back in but apparently not so I approached this completely wrong see if I can get it in anyways I guess I can. Uh, park and brake. Uh, turn off the engine. We will decouple. Uh, so this is to... Boy, the paper I usually sc write my scrap notes on is getting full of, well, scrap notes. Uh, i got to find some place to put it here. Because I want to make sure I deliver it to all five. So this is the Artsworks. Okay, so what, uh, if I just hit continue, am I still on the map, or are you going to, can I see the map that we're on? So, I'm just going to say this is the North Pole. Uh, there is a viewpoint over here. All right, we'll have to hit that. And then maybe go visit, I think we actually have to go back to a teleportation area. And I think what would happen is because when we took the job, there were four places I could go to teleport to. If I go back to this one, I'll end up back at the gas station. If I go to the other three, it'll spit me out somewhere else. Possibly. Possibly. Um, so one of five, one of 15. All right. Uh, wait, can I take? Is there a job market here? There is. All right, so wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. Let me go. <laughs> uh, post office, town square, chocolate factory, either one. Post office. Uh, but do I want do I want to go back to Kansas, or is there one going to Marysville? I'm having my own little Christmas here. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, I'm looking for. Well, how about we just type in? Nope, not that's that's the wrong key. Okay, so nothing going to Marysville. That would have been that would have been too convenient. I, 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 does it really matter where I go? Because I'm going to be coming back here, and eventually, maybe I can go back to Kansas. All right, so there's one to Emporia, and that's from the post office. So we'll take this one. Yes, we will begin delivery. Um, it says WL. Is that to stand for Winterland? Maybe. 
Could be. Let's go ahead and uh, first I want to visit this this over here. Oh wait, is there no trailer's not behind me? Well, the truck didn't really want to back up in R three for some reason. It's like I'm spinning my tires. Maybe I should get out and put chains on. Nah, that's the wrong game. All right, here's the viewpoint over here. So it doesn't seem to be any traffic. Well, I hear music over there. I don't know if it's copyrighted or not, though. Activate viewpoint. Uh, Rudolph's Village. Okay, so there's a skating rink there. And of course, everyone up front is on their cell phones. Can't go out and enjoy time with their family. The kids are out there skating around, probably falling down, breaking their face on the ice. I wonder if there's actually going to be another viewpoint where we might be able to see Santa Claus themselves. The tree looks uh, well done, decorated over with the lights and the uh, Christmas bulbs on it. Alright, but that's enough joy. <laughs> we need to get back to work, right? Nine o'clock in the morning. I don't know if it's uh, dark like this because I'm up here in Winterland. I think that's what we'll call it for now because um, maybe that's what it's called. I have no idea. Or is it the winter mod that I'm running that just makes it that kind of dark at 930 in the morning still? This is different, definitely a different touch than what I usually do. I usually go to Nevada and just take those from Topana to Ellie, back and forth. But I mean, really, so far from what I can see, these are short deliveries. But you still got to travel in between. But at least they give us a different area that you know we haven't been on before, so we get different. A uh, different view of things. Uh, probably next week. I will go ahead and put the prob 
probability of precipitation up a lot higher. So it's snowing more. Let's see, this is going out on the 17th of December. Yeah, so next week will be... Oh, it'll be Christmas Eve next... Wow, okay. Um, yeah, it'll be Christmas Eve for next week. So, uh, yeah, I'll definitely go ahead and just probably just put it on 100% so it snows all the time. Of course, it only matters to those who are watching the video roughly when the video comes up. If you're watching this, you know, six months from now, it's going to be July. And you're like, I, I don't care that it's snowing out. It's July. We got another viewpoint. So, you know, we got to go ahead and check these out. Uh, because it's here for a month doing this. And if I only do one episode per week, that's four weeks. That means, I mean, four episodes I'll be able to do. And um, we'll see how it goes. I may have to throw an extra episode in there at some point. I may get some of these, uh, of the other 15 complete deliveries done on my other profile. But as for visiting all five spots up here, we'll do it in this profile. So you guys can see it for the ones who aren't doing it or the ones who don't play ATS but enjoy watching the videos. Are we going to be able to drive over any ice? Have our own little ice road uh, trucking going on up here. Well, they do have a train that goes through here. Of course, maybe this circles around. Kind of a peaceful village with no traffic going around. I was going to say, what the heck? <laughs> it's my loan payment going through. I'm like, did you just charge me for the view? Exactly. All right, there's our trailer. In case you didn't know, that's the thing with the the white cone pointing at it, <laughs> saying, "Hey, this is yours." I wasn't trying to back up to, I was trying to get squared away, get around the snowbank that's here. Alright, we are locked and loaded. Oh, that's right. Now I got to pick out. I kind of forgot. I got to pick out where, um, where I want to go. So we kind of been around here. Um, let, let's go up to this one up here. Kind of interested what this might be. I feel like I'm, I'm sightseeing today is what I'm doing.
keep looking for traffic, but I just haven't seen any so far. So I probably shouldn't expect any. So I'll be curious that when we get back to uh, Kansas, right? Am I going to Kansas with this load? Emporia, yeah. Uh, when I get there, is it going to be brighter than it is here? Or is this the winter mod? Because being winter, the sun's going to be low. It's just not going to be as bright. All the wrong gears. As long as I'm not grinding the gears, we're all set. I may not actually work the full day today either because <laughs> I'm taking a lot of time sightseeing and I don't want the video to go on extremely long. So this will probably be the last delivery of the day. It'd be really great though if I can get <laughs> one of these contracts going to Marysville. But this will have me focused a little bit on just getting these deliveries done. So we're not, we're not actually driving around Kansas, which I thought we'd be able to do. We're teleporting up here to Winterland, or whatever this is called. At least my drivers are still out there bringing in the cash. We're we gonna go through a tunnel. Uh, no, we're teleporting. All right, so I don't really need to back into it. Sorry, I'm just looking up there to try to figure out what might be neutral. No, that's third gear. So I don't really need to park into it. You're just going to need to get into it. Uh, stop engine and press the button. Go through the portal. This is this is weird, but interesting, but fun. <laughs> in, some, in, a, in a way, I, I can't explain it, but it's just I think it's because it's not what I was expecting for the winter deliveries to be like. I will say the truck was definitely handling handling weird on the snow roads there than it was in Kansas earlier. Well, definitely a lot brighter here. lot lot brighter here I mean maybe I'll just end the episode after this delivery but I'll keep it in the same in-game day we can continue on next episode could always do that
Uh, but usually I like to try to keep it one day per episode. That way I can kind of keep track of, uh, you know, I can just go by, hey, it's episode, like we're at what, 205 or something like that now. So that tells me I played 205 days in in-game days. So I probably should keep up with that. And it doesn't really matter if I take more jobs steady or not. Hey, get out of my way, dude. I'm delivering Christmas gifts. Or what am I delivering? Mail and gift parcels. Parcels. Not parcels, but parcels. I'm delivering it to my row or my my route. Well, I'm kind of glad we're, we're able to take trailers up in Winterland. Uh, Happen to travel all the way back with nothing, kind of would stink a little bit but this is uh, this is working out well now I understand the process of what we got to do originally I thought after I saw like we, well we got to click on uh, you know I thought we we're just going to a gas station I'm like wait am I delivering to a gas station then what oh no I, okay we're teleporting that's kind of interesting okay The only thing with the snow on the road, it just makes it a little bit difficult to see where the turning lanes are. But other than that, we're doing all right. Well, I found a truck dealer. Am I pulling into to Swift? Or no, I think they want me from what GPS is telling me. I think GPS wants me uh, over there. I said my rue outside and I wasn't paying no attention. Uh, shift to first gear, there we go. Now this is Ashley as far as I can see. Uh, but they call it my rue because they serve a contract. Uh, where where, oh, where am I going with this? Am I dropping it down in here? Ooh, right up against the wall, too. Okay. Uh, but before I do, I kind of need to take somewhat of a thumbnail today, so... Alright, this is probably going to take me... Maybe two tries? Yeah, I didn't uh, pull forward far enough, I think. Uh, but I think I might be able to get it in. Uh, no, I'm hitting... Hitting some, uh... Pile of debris there. Yep. Not good. Am I going to hit it again? No. Nope. 
I did say two tries, probably. And decouple. Show results. We'll just continue. So two of the five depots done, but we'll definitely get all five of those done on this profile. I may get some deliveries on my other profile to catch up. And at some point, we'll try to catch up with Marysville. Uh, let me go to the world map. Is there a... Uh, there is a garage... Uh, actually, right here. I don't think I need a fuel up. Uh, the amount of fuel that we're using, we're just going to go right on. I'm trying to think, is that the entryway right there? I think so. Uh, let's go ahead and scoot on over. Not a full day's worth of driving, but we did see a lot. And as, as I did say, I didn't want the episodes to go too long because I'm sightseeing quite a bit. Uh, the driving seems to be a little bit on the slower side because we're enjoying the view. And I did it did take me a while to figure out the beginning exactly what we were doing. But now we got it under controlled and we know what we're doing. Uh, can I get into there from here? I don't think so. It's a Peterbilt, the sister truck of a Kenny, or the brother truck, or the cousin truck, whatever you want to call it. So they'll let me park here and stay overnight. There we go. Take up probably all four parking spots. Uh, but there we have it. Uh, the winter deliver deliveries have begun. Uh, but now I just realized that next week, uh, next week's episode will be Christmas Eve. So if I want to do a Christmas paint job, I gotta, I gotta kind of get on it right now. Uh, but we will turn on snow uh, precipitation to like 100%. So it's constantly snowing. I probably won't play any Christmas music if there's any Christmas music that we hear. It'll be just like what we heard today, going to Rudolph Center or Rink or whatever heck it was. Um, but yeah, we got to keep going up to Winterland or North Pole, whatever they're calling it. And uh, we'll get a couple more deliveries done up there. And hopefully, eventually, we'll find our way around to Marysville, which is the last city in Kansas I have not been to. Uh, right up here. And there's only two, three companies up there. So maybe that's why... I don't know if these companies here are considered Marysville. They're probably more of Topeka. Torpeka? Uh, Topeka. Uh, but pro yeah, probably only three companies up here. So maybe that's why it's hard to get external contracts up there. So I may have to find a load or just eventually go up there and take an external contract out of there. And uh, that'll complete that. But um, yeah, who knows? Or maybe, wait, where am I? I'm in, are we in Topeka? No, we're, I forgot where I was. Emporia. I think we're in Emporia. There we go. Maybe maybe I'll drive up there, and that way when we start next episode, I'll be in Marysville, and we can do a Christmas delivery out of there, and I'll complete both. Um, I may do that, because technically I got four and a half hours left on my watch to drive, so I, I might do that. But anyways, that's going to do it for today, guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the episode. I do appreciate you watching, as always. I'll catch you again right here in American Truck Simulator, but until then, have a good one.